Good morning. Uh, New Day Fitness here with Ramona. Um, today is April 30th and it is my weigh-in day. Um, yesterday I wasn't feeling too good, but I still ate right and I still went for a walk and stuff. So kind of excited about that. I'm kind of excited about my weigh-in to see where I'm at. My first week was a lot harder than what I thought it was going to be. But I'll get into that because um, today I got to go do my grocery haul and I got, I'm going to meal prep. I'm going to try some new stuff because this week, like I said, it was harder than what I thought. So um, definitely going to try some new stuff this week. And anyways, so I'm about to do my weigh in and so I got to, you know, weigh in. So here it goes. 186. What? Julian, what are you doing? Yeah, always have to know that. Good morning, Jojo. Good morning. I'm actually excited. Good morning, Jaden. I'm actually excited about that number. So, 186. What do you think, Jaden? Oh, he. Mm, he's a troublemaker. Okay, so I am actually really, really excited about that because uh, Sunday, I did good. Monday, did good. Tuesday, I did not get to work out. No, Tuesday, I did. I went and worked out. Sunday, I didn't work out. I just walked around. Monday, I did work out. Tuesday, I worked out. Yeah, Monday I got up like at 6 o'clock in the morning went to go work out. Tuesday I went to go work out after I got off work. Wednesday I did not get to work out. Um, and I when I say work out, uh, I'm going to do two weeks of just cardio. As much cardio as I can. Wednesday I didn't get to work out. Thursday I didn't get to work out. Friday I didn't get to work out. Or cardio, whatever. Um, Wednesday was a very bad day for me. I went to my sister's, uh, she made chicken, it was amazing, um, uh, did good, I stayed there, worked, then on my way home, you know, I called the husband, I said, hey, you want anything to eat? He said, yeah, give me some Taco Bell. I, you know, after I left my sister, after I ate lunch, I didn't eat again, so when I left my sister's, so when I ended up going to um taco bell i ended up ordering like four items off the dollar menu which was really amazing to me because i drank a gallon almost a gallon of water like 15 um julian get out of there go these crazy animals always trying to get into things anyways um so i almost drank a gallon of water but i still ate four items then i had to stop at the store to get some laundry detergent and guess what I saw I see the lady in front of me she I don't know what was going on with her credit card or whatever but I just so happened turned to the right and I saw some ho hoes peanut butter hoes and did I eat one hell turn no, I had to eat all three you know big girl big girl had to eat all three but anyways so I'm just I'm, I guess I'm just ramping and raging over I lost six pounds and I'm really excited about that and um because i had i didn't have one of my best weeks so i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna buy a calendar thing and i'm gonna start marking all the days that i get to go to the gym and hopefully that helps me you know i'm like really trying it's a journey ramona you know that it's a journey it takes time but six pounds i knew it i knew i was gonna lose some weight um so I'm just really excited about that. 186. It's good. It's a good number. So I'm going to show you my grocery haul. I'm going to show you what I'm going to eat. And then this is pretty much going to wrap up the video. Just because I really, really stressed about my first week and how I went. And this is how my videos are going to basically go. It's hard. I'm probably going to talk a lot for the first five minutes. And then the rest will just be my grocery haul and stuff. 
right, so I got my cafecito, as you can see, and I'm headed out to do groceries. Have to leave these heathens here. Hopefully, I don't come to a mess. Y'all behave now. You hear me, Jojo? All right, guys, so I went on my grocery haul. Let me see if I can switch this around. Uh, hold on. All right, so I went on my grocery haul, and I actually got quite a bit. What is that? Anyways, I got quite a bit of stuff. Which, so I'm guessing it's going to last us about two weeks. Um, but here's what I got. Let's see if I can switch this over. All right, so we're going to start off with the meats. Um, I got two of these because they were only $2.99, and I got two of these because, you know, $6.39 can't beat it. Gonna make some chicken, gonna make some beef in the crock pot with some vegetables. I'm really happy they had these because these will be quick and easy. Just warm them up, put some vegetables, and then I got a lot, a lot, a lot of fruits and vegetables. Strawberries I was so happy last time, these were $4.99. I got these for 99 cents, so that's I'm really excited about that. Um, I was going to get some frozen vegetables, but I said, hey, what the heck, I'm just going to make a big pan of cabbage with some uh, carrots, uh, some purple cabbage, some peppers, and then I'm going to make stuffed bell peppers, and I'm going to make a stuffed chicken in the oven, mushrooms, got me some potatoes, uh, some blueberries, all right, uh, Let's move over here. I got me some coffee. Got me some of this uh, to put in my rice. I got me these. They're kind of expensive. I mean, I don't really know. They're ten for ten dollars. Um, I got them because I can take them to go. So that's the reason why I got that. I uh, got two jars of pickles. William eats the crap out of pickles. Got some mozzarella for my stuffed chicken. These were only 99 cents. So I got two. These right here are for William. I got me this bread, only 35 calories. I got me some egg whites because I didn't have none this week. Uh, so I got this cucumber ranch. I was really kind of excited about this one. So that's going to be interesting. It's in a bag. Cool. Brown rice. Oh, this too. I was, I'm going to put this in my uh, shake in the morning. Help it. It's triple zero. So, really excited about that. The peanut butter. got this big ass peanut butter for William. He's been eating the crap out of that. And I got me some of this because I figured I could put on my tuna, get a little bit of taste. Really excited about that. And then I got me some oats because I've seen a recipe. Uh, where they use oats or I want to try those pancakes too so um, so yeah this is my grocery haul. oh I got these I got some, uh, some vegetables and then I got these kind of broccoli and cheese kind of excited about those so yeah that's my grocery haul as you can see it's really excited uh, really excited now it's time to wash the dishes and still aren't meal prepping for the whole week. So, <sighs> so yeah, guys, um, probably this is going to be the end of my video. Um, some thoughts. Uh, last time I, uh, I cheated. This past week I cheated. Um, I thought I was just going to jump right on the wagon and take off like I've been doing it for a while. Um, but no, it was actually hard. The temptation was a lot harder than I thought. Um, I didn't get to go do my cardio as much as I wanted to. I only got to do it three days uh, this past week. I'm going to shoot for four days at least. So, you know, I'm just it's a journey. And I have to realize that it's a journey. And I don't, I just try to take off right out of the gate. And it's not going to happen like that, especially with my job. Things happen. Schedules change. My schedule changes all the time, uh, so no matter how well I plan it, something's going to come up and I have to take care of it and I have to do it and it is what it is and I cheated uh, Wednesday, 
I didn't get to, no, yeah, Wednesday and then Thursday, Friday, I didn't even get to go do any cardio. Another thing is when I did my hour and a hour of cardio, my uh, Tuesday, I noticed I wasn't really sweating. So I was like, what am I doing? You know, like I inclined it hardcore, like it was like 12.5 and you know, I was like, so I was like, why am I sweating? So yesterday I was like, okay, I'm got to sweat. Like I'm drinking a lot of water and I'm peeing a lot, but like I wasn't sweating. So I was just kind of worried about that. But anyways, it's a journey. You will make it. It's week number two. I'll probably show you what I'm going to eat. Uh, this morning I had three strips of bacon. I also had uh, one egg because we ran out of eggs. And one good thing, too, is I boiled, like, 18 eggs. Was it 18? 12 or 18 eggs. And it was really good because I just go in the fridge, eat an egg. So another thing, too, was this week that I learned was my calories. It's a lot harder because, like, you drink the shake and that's about 200 calories. And then for lunch, it's, it's, it's whenever I get home that I want to eat dinner with William and I end up I I'm not getting my calories I'm not getting all of my calories so I'm working on that I'm gonna work on that this week I'm trying to maybe plan maybe because usually I work nine to five so maybe a lunch and then maybe like a I don't know patty and maybe some vegetables or something I don't know but anyways I had a pretty good week. I lost six pounds, but it's just going to get harder. So, got to hang in there. Push. Push yourself. Uh, you know you can do better. Try to go to the gym four times a week this week. And so, this is my video. It's where I'm probably going to just show you what I'm going to eat because I need to eat. But I need to make me something to eat. It's probably fry me up a patty. Ham, uh, turkey patty some vegetables and that's probably what I'm gonna eat and then we'll see all right so here's my lunch three ounces of tip roast um, with some mushrooms and a cup and a half of vegetables I got my uh, roast with vegetables going Gotta wash all these damn dishes, put all that stuff up. I forgot to get foil, so I forgot to get foil, so I gotta run and get some foil. Oh, let me show you. And then this is what I wanna end with. Look at my vegetables. Look at my, uh, hold on, give me one. All right, look at my vegetables, looking all nice. And then in here, go put some spinach. Got the vegetables cooking. It's gonna be a good week, guys. Gotta stay positive. Look at that food one more time. Look at that. Eating like that that's the thing is that's the thing I think why so many people are overweight because it's so easy to go to a drive thru. It's it's hard, like planning it especially if you have a job if you don't have a job it's a little bit more easier but if you have a job you have to plan your week out plan your meals it's it's rough but anyways i'm gonna end the video right there comment like i said last time please be positive i really need the positivity in my life uh subscribe if you ain't subscribed yet i only got 10 little subscribers but um and share you know if this video helps one person out that's on the journey like me struggling fat to fit fat to fit fat to fit um, you know then hey I help somebody out anyways y'all have a blessed Sunday a good week be positive be the positivity that you need in your life to somebody else's life